four fair eyes. I want to see how they reach, you know. Both in a age and in a, you know, when they're doing the music right now. Yeah, man, yeah, man, that's true. I have an album out right now, Team Different. Yeah. So when I put up music from, you know, Skinny Jeans, from the first track, when I put out radio, what would you say is the biggest difference from then till now? You know, the biggest difference really is just growth. Yeah. Because, you know, over the years we've been, you know, um, attentive in our craft and, you know, everything we do. So, you know, it's a lot of changes. And when you listen to the album, Team Different, you can definitely hear the changes over the past few years. What was the big up on the album? Is there listening? Okay. Yeah. Like you know, I just want to work on it. Yeah, man. All produced by UTPSD. So, it's the first project on the Uptown Gaza record. So, that's our new record label. Yeah. yeah, so, Team Different, all produced by all of the tracks. Then. You know, and we got Red Boom to mix all of the tracks. Then. Yeah. Right, all right, all right. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> I yeah. saw yeah. that because we saw the track list and it, you guys' names are on it. So, the song, though, that you guys were going for, um, it's, it's eclectic, it's different, but you know, obviously it's not straight dance all. So what was the vibe going into producing the, 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 the album itself? You know, well, as always, we just always have fun with the music and you know, it was just coming up to the two year anniversary of Skinny Jeans. Because mm-hmm. after we did Job Skinny Jeans, the song we did end up with the EP and you know, Skinny Jeans end up being a grand father, so you know, he did do good, so decided to want to do a new album, so we just really did. but at the same time we didn't know say we want to come across different and you know make a stamp right now it's good. so there was a, like when you producing the album is like say this is what like the brand or even the the sound and the niche that you're trying to to fit in or stand out in like just in terms of just the production well, the production wise we never try fit in we always try stand out so it's the title team different you know so even though going into the studio and listening to all of the rhythm and things, we try our fun, we always try to be versatile at the same time, you know? Yeah. So that was definitely a big part of it. And then even the... Uh, you know, get enough to, to the guy the more. Right. Yeah, man, definitely, because when you, when you check the album now, more than half of the song them are for the females, yeah. so, you know, that we are doing, you know, guys are always cater for the girls themselves. So. And but, like, there's no thing to it, you know, whining, whining song, but there's songs for the girls. Yeah. You want to be it, yeah, because I listened to the album, yeah, so there's no song for wine, so, but obviously it was, um... Uh, hey, hey girl, too, that's a, you know, yeah. hey girl, that's a for the girl, them can wine, said we, so, you know, yeah, when you when when say, but you're going to go to the song, yeah. <laughs> All right, no problem, So that was the intent, if in going into making the album or because, you know, they say, maybe the complaints now, I work. get loud up because yeah, I'm assuming it was way before. Yeah. We write them songs that before every yeah. time. Yeah, yeah, man, yeah, see, yeah. There was a lot of girls' songs, so that was definitely the aim. To get both the girls' songs they want to do it because of them songs they chart them songs. Mm. So, you know, so, yeah, that was the plan for well, international boy. Mm. You can definitely hear it. Well, I mean, yes, sir. Yes, sir. You have to bring up your father, of course, you have to. So it's like, even he's like one of the main, I guess, go-to for girl songs. So like, even like, was it a case where you have to listen to him and study it and say, well, the formula, you think there's a formula when it goes into writing a, a perfect girl song, or? Well, you know, everything you do still when you're there in the studio, because, um, and I like say when we did a um, record whole album, we we'll go back and we we'll assist it and we we'll say, ah, we're going to make this and see what he's doing, you know? Because the members say, our oh, father, so over the years we've been at this music and things, so, you know, that wasn't the case. But definitely, when you write a song, them, you always have your own remedy. Mm. Whenever I feel the weight of being sons of possibly the greatest dancehall artist ever, but I don't ever feel that. Yeah, definitely, because dancehall artist ever, you know, so. When you're there in the studio and you're there thing, you know, you always want to do your best, but at the same time, you want to create a lane for yourself, you know? So that's why with this album, Team Different, we didn't have no feature. And you know, we could have got a million features, and you know, just want to do it as you. I'm respect team. about it too, yeah, man. What about you, Ari? Well, there are people of high, expect- high expectation of this, so yeah. We always try to put out the best things possible so them can say, yeah. I really vibes cartels on them. Yeah.
Amin.